Hi, animation movie lovers! Did you watch the 2021 computer animated adventure comedy film Back to the Outback? The film story was written by Gregory Lessons and Harry Cripps. The film is one of the best films of 2021. Do you know all the film characters are taken from real life? Yes! I hope you'll like to watch them in real life from where they have been taken. So let's get started in the video. If this is your first time watching our channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button below. <laughs> Number 1. Pretty Boy Pretty Boy is a boy in this film. Pretty Boy character is a famous celebrity character. While Maddie and her friends were abused for being monsters, he was loved by the audience. When they decided to escape the zoo, Pretty Boy tried to call guards for them, but he was stopped by Nigel, who poisoned him to pass him out. But accidentally, he flew in front of the camera and it took a photo of his creepy face. The group decided to take him with them. He is voiced by Australian comedian, actor, and writer Timothy David Minchkin. Tim, uh... What do you think? Will he look also pretty in real life? Yes, he's also a cute animal in real life. The writer got this idea from a koala. The koala is an arboreal, herborvious, marsupial native to Australia. Look, his big ear and nose make him look too pretty. What is your opinion about this real life pretty boy? Does he look pretty and as famous as he does in the film Back in the Outback? The koala is found in coastal areas of the mainland's eastern and southern regions. It is the only extant representative of the family, Fascolaritidae, and is the closest living relative are the wombats, including Queensland, New South Wales, Victoria, and South Australia. Next, number two, Zoe. Zoe is one of the major characters of Back to the Outback. We know that Zoe also lived in the zoo since her childhood, like Frank. Zoe is an outspoken, unimpressive reptile, almost always jaded and sometimes mocking. She doesn't like inappropriate remarks about her. She openly despised Pretty Boy for his obnoxious behavior, as well as the times he used her as a comb. Though the two would eventually become friends towards the end of the journey. When they were fighting against Ekinrock, Zoe almost made a lot of clever things to win. She is voiced by Australian actress Miranda Tapsell. In real life, Zoe is a thorny devil and commonly known as Thorny Lizard. Zoe is much the same in real life as in the movie. Especially his body thorn is perfect. Look, the same. So, how does she look in real life? Look at the prickly skin on the body, which looks really scary. Do you know in real life you can care for her gently and she won't hurt you? She's good, like in the movies and in real life too. The species is endemic to Australia. It is the sole species in the Montlock. So what's your opinion about Zoe? Let us know in the comments below. Next, number three, Nigel. Nigel is one of the main characters of the film. Nigel, unlike the rest of the group, resembles the correlation of his species in real life. When they escape from the zoo, Nigel knocks the pretty boy unconscious with his poison. Pretty boy interrupts their escape. Nigel's big eyes make him look cuter. He is voiced by British actor Angus Imry. Here is real life Nigel. In real life, he is a scorpion. Although the film show Nigel's poison is not a big issue, but in real life, don't touch them because their poison one drop can confirm your death. In the movie, and in real life, Nigel is the same, but in this movie, his eyes make him look adorable, which he does not have in real life. The evolutionary history of scorpions goes back 435 million years. So what do you think about Nigel? Also, drop a comment below. Next, number four, Maddie. Maddie is the major character of this film. You can think of her as the main character of the movie. She is a girl snake. She is a big hearted snake who lived in the Sydney Zoo, where she was always presented as a vile creature to humans until she got tired of being treated like a monster. She's also known as Medusa on stage in the zoo. She is voiced by Australian actress Isla Fisher. Here is the real life Maddie, a big hearted inland Taipan snake. Blue Pit Viper is the rare blue variety of the white lipped island Pit Viper. Aw, oh, was this what you expected she would look like in real life? What do you think? Really, she's so cute. The cutest snake I've ever seen. Although the writer got this character's idea from Inland Tapian, I think the writer just made a copy of this real-life snake and put it into the script. 
It's actually created and follows as the Blue Pit Viper. The species is found in Indonesia and East Timor. Look, but don't touch. This snake is not a creature you would want to mess with. No matter how beautiful Blue Pit Vipers appear, they are dangerously venomous in real life. So what's your opinion about Maddie after watching her in real life? Let us know in the comments below. Next, number five, Frank. Frank is a tarantula. Little is known about Frank's past. The only thing we know is that he was sent to the Australian Zoo as a child. Despite being kind and friendly to everyone, Frank is regularly used as a dangerous creature. Frank was voiced by Australian actor Guy Pearce. Here is Frank in real life. He's the most beautiful, more than in the movie. The movie Frank and real life Frank are also so cute. But Frank is dangerous in real life. Like we watched in the movie, everyone thought Frank is dangerous, although he's not. Really, he's cuter to look at. What do you say? Isn't he cute? Frank wanted this compliment in the film. Anyway, we gave him this compliment in our video. The writer made Frank characters by observing a funnel web spider that was found in central New South Wales, Australia. But in real life, Frank is matched by Brazilian purple tarantula. It is found in Brazil and Ecuador. As beautiful as he is in the movie, his eyes are terrifying in real life. Who would want him in real life? Next, number six, Jack. Jackie's a female character. Jackie grew up in a channel near some mountains, and she was always impressed by how huge and majestic they seemed. Jackie quickly gained a reputation as the most infamous animal in the Australian Wildlife Park. Jackie's characters create a big sense of suspense at the end of the movie. It's unknown exactly how, but Jackie managed to escape. She says she learned some tricks from Zoe, indicating, like Zoe, she managed to loosen a part of her cage to let herself out. She also says she was head of the rescue team, indicating another animal from USS helped, which we watched at the last end of the movie and became surprised. Jackie was voiced by Australian television actress Jackie Weaver. Here's Jackie in real life, the Nile Crocodile. She is really awesome, although the movie's Jackie's eyes are more adorable. Look at the real-life Jackie's face. She's more adorable looking. She's like a pet. The Nile Crocodile is a large crocodilian native to freshwater habitats in Africa, where it is present in 26 countries. So, how much did you enjoy our video? Did you like this video or not? Please comment below and also comment on what you think to watch in the next video. We will try to complete your wish. Thank you.